La Nabi Abadi, there will be no prophet after me. Many Muslims believe that no prophet can come after the Holy Prophet, peace be upon him. Yet they also believe Prophet Jesus will return in the latter days. These two positions are completely contradictory. That is why we Ahmadi Muslims believe that Khatam al Nabiji means the seal and best of all the prophets. But we could argue that the Holy Prophet said that there will be no prophet after me. So we should accept what he said and ignore any interpretations. Yes, absolutely, if he himself had not clarified this point. The Holy Prophet cleared up any confusion and ambiguity. Just like he said, La Nabi Abadi, that there will be no prophet after me. After Fatah Makkah, he said, La Hijrata Bad al Fat, that there will be no migration after the conquest of Makkah. And this is according to Bukhari and Muslim. But we see that migration happens every day. He also said that when Caesar dies, there will be no Caesar after him. But kings still came after him. Hence, it must have meant in might and power. This clearly proves that the message behind the phrase La Nabi Abadi was meant to be understood in the context of grandeur and majesty. Also, if he meant there will be no prophet after me, then he wouldn't have said, as Ibn Daud records, there is no prophet between me and him. La Nabi Abadi therefore means that there never was, nor will be, a prophet greater in status than the Holy Prophet, and that he is and will forever remain the final law-bearing messenger sent by God.